Let's get more on this now from Owen Holdaway, who joins me live from the capital, Beirut. Owen, why are protesters seemingly not accepting this new government? I think as they largely see it as a cosmetic change on what was before, it doesn't really solve the fundamental demands of what the protests have been asking for, which is essentially a wiping out of the whole system and a forming of a technocratic government. Um, this government is largely seen as in the even more sectarian than, than the Hariri administration that was before. A lot of the uh, the Sunni parties and the Druze parties have actually been excluded, so it's, it's, it's in many ways it's worse. So there's the reaction to it, particularly on the street initially last night, is very bad, and there's more protests set the set for set for today outside parliament and as as for last weekend as it swelled uh, i think the protesters were again were again hit to the street against this against this government because essentially it doesn't solve the fundamental demands that they've been asking for since the start of this this this, this uprising over 3 months ago right yeah as you said these protests have been going on for over 3 months now so what are protesters likely to do next I mean, based on what happened last time, uh, you know, it may it may get significantly worse. On on Saturday, uh, some of the protests became significantly more violent, and also because of the way the security services responded to them. I think there's a general frustration of the fact that there that there isn't being any political political change. They aren't being listened to. Um, they reverted to their tactics of, uh, of closing streets, burning tires, and various things like that. So that will likely continue. I think it really depends upon how the how the security services respond when there's likely to be a mass gathering again again this weekend. Um, so it, it really is, I think, uh, Lebanon's very much on a knife edge, both politically and economically, because the economy as well is really suffering here now. The, 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 and, that, and that is adding to the frustration, of, not just of the general po protest, but also of the wider, wider population. All right, we'll leave it there. Owen Holdaway live in Beirut. Owen, thank you.